So, hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to animate a video using artificial intelligence. To do this, we'll need stable diffusion and its extensions, control net and move to move. So, let's go. Step 1. Download the portable version of stable diffusion. Why portable? Because we don't have to bother installing Gitty and Python. Go to this link. As always, I will include all the links in the description. Click on the code and download the archive. Once the archive is downloaded, unzip it. This folder is deleted. We do not need it anymore. Go to the folder with files. And we are interested in this file. Click on it twice. And all the necessary components are installed and pulled in automatically. We don't have to do anything else, just wait. It takes about 30 minutes and I'm going to cut this out to keep the video short. After all the files have been downloaded, we will automatically have an interface like this. Now the second step is to install ControlNet. Go to extension here, click on this button. We write ControlNet in this box. Here you can see that I already have it installed and you click on install, done. After that, restart stable diffusion. Now we have ControlNet installed. We need to download a model for it. Go to this link. I, for example, like to work with LineArt. Click Download and save in the Stable Diffusion Models ControlNet folder. I already have it downloaded. The next step is to download the model for Stable Diffusion. Go to this link. I really like this style, but there are a lot of models here. Click Download. Download to the folder, Stable Diffusion, Models, Stable Diffusion. Again, I have it already downloaded. After all these manipulations, we reboot Stable Diffusion. One last thing, we need to download the Move to Move extension for Stable Diffusion. Go to this link, it is also in the description. Click on the code but do not download the archive, but copy this link here. Click on copy here. Go back to stable diffusion, extension, download from the link, paste this link right here. I have it already loaded. Once you have it loaded, you need to restart stable diffusion. So we've done all that. We can start processing the video. I'm going to be processing this video. Go to the move to move tab. Click into this window. We're looking for our video that we want to process. Click on Open. You can also just drag and drop your file. Very important. Click on this ruler here to have Stable Diffusion pull up the correct aspect ratio for the video. If it doesn't, the video will just be square and not very attractive. We set the frames to 15 right here. This is the feature that we're going to close for now, because in this video I'm showing a simple, or one of the simple ways, we're not going to bother with any extra settings. Let's go to control net, turn it on. I'm turning on the optional pixel perfect. Select the model we have loaded. I choose LineRT preprocessor. Realistic, but you can play around. Here we select the stable diffusion model, in the style of which we will process our video. Since I have only one model, it is the default. It is very important that the model works correctly. We need to enter this word into our prompt, copy it and paste it into the prompt field. You can of course add more description, but I want the video to remain as it was, but in this style. So I take only this word. I don't write anything else. That's it, we've set up stable diffusion and we can start processing. The generation takes about 22 minutes on my laptop with an RTX 3060 and 6 gigabytes of memory. You might have a different experience. I was previously on a laptop with an RTX 3050 with 4 gigabytes of memory and it took a very long time. So while I'm waiting, my 25 minutes for you with the magic of editing will fly by in an instant. Well, here it is. The processing is complete and let's take a look at the result. Here is the original and our processed video. 
Literally in 30 minutes, we made a video that can be uploaded to TikTok or YouTube. That's it, friends. Now you know how to install and use Stable Diffusion, Control Net, and Move to Move to create amazing videos using artificial intelligence. If you like the video, then put a like, subscribe to the channel, and click on the bell so you don't miss new videos. Thanks for watching and see you soon. Bye, everyone.